Okay, so now I've found another little couple of secluded beaches called Papa'a Beach along the Aliumanu, I think it's spelled Aliumanu Reef. And you can see the water is quite dark apart from the sun just being behind clouds. Um, there's reef very um, quickly beneath the water surface here so it's very shallow at the moment the tide must be out um, not really a swimming beach because you without um, shoes and stuff I wouldn't go in there and it's too shallow you'll damage the reef that's probably mostly dead anyway already so I don't want to damage it anymore um, probably a lot of turtles in there be nice for snorkeling when the tide is a bit higher and I've just seen a couple of manta rays in there as well or stingrays not mantas stingrays smaller ones so there's quite a bit of um, life around here Papa Art Beach a little gem probably a morning beach there we go Okay, this is now Papa'a Bay, gorgeous bay, again, very secluded, can barely get here, if you don't know, it's not really signposted much, um, Exes is not really here for the general public, well there is technically, because all the beaches are have to be accessible but um, there's no big parking lots anywhere near it so it's very quiet and just gorgeous this bay is just beautiful and so calm I might just walk to the end there's one fisherman up there I just spoke to a local who started chatting he said it was so beautiful during COVID Nobody was here on this island. Everything was empty and it was gorgeous. As you can imagine, and now it's a lot busier again, but um, these little gems people don't really know about. So I shall remember this little bay that's gorgeous. I'm at the end of the bay now, looking back to the other side, gorgeous. And the sun's behind clouds, every time I take the camera out. And another stream again that's trying to push into the ocean, but as it's not really running much, stand much of a chance Papa'a Bay apparently used just last week in a film set they've been here for seven days filming here for some movie 